the first time that we had a really good Aurora show and I had a camera capable of capturing it. I went out and I started shooting and I was so excited and I got home and all these pictures looked way darker than I thought they would. And here it turns out I had left the polarizer filter on front of my lens. So that's kind of my number one tip is make sure you don't have any filters on the front of your lenses. Bujou, Anin Eji Ayayan, Travis Indigenikaz, Makwa Indodem, Kichi Onigaming Indunjaba. Hello, how are you? My name is Travis. I am Bear Clan. I am from Grand Portage. In my case, I always photograph with my camera in manual mode. And so when I start shooting, I'll generally start off with the Aurora with the ISO set at 800 and an exposure time of around 20 to 30 seconds. Probably my favorite thing to do is to, during the daytime, drive around and check out areas that have been logged where you can get lights in between these, say, six or seven pine trees. And that, to me, ends up with like the coolest looking forest views, at least. The Slice, from WDSE WRPT.